Welcome to another After Effects tutorial. Today we're gonna create a Plexus Effects using After Effects CC. First thing, we're gonna create a new composition. Click on New Composition and then hit OK. Next, we're gonna create a new solid. Let's make it so dark. Then go to the effects and presets panel and search for Plexus. You'll find the Plexus plugin download link in the description. Let me adjust this panel. Like this. And add a new geometry. Click on primitives. Add an effector and then click on noise. Then increase the noise amplitude. Then add a render and click on the lines. Go to the lines render panel and increase the maximum distance. To, uh, something like uh, 193 increase uh, the number of vertices a few uh, let's make it 34 and click on the plexus noise effector and go to noise details and alt click on noise evolution and tip time store 10 that will make uh, the plexus line move around themselves. So let's add a cool gradient effect to it. Tip gradient ramp in the effects and presets panel. And go to the gradient ramp panel. Change the ramp shape to uh, something like uh, radial or linear as you want. I will make it uh, something uh, radial and increase the ramp to make it so smooth. Then change the color to violet. That's the first. And the second color, let's uh, change it to. Uh, something like grid that's cool as you see the plexus effect runs perfectly with beautiful colors so let's add some text Um, let's check Plexus. You'll find the font download link in the description. Let's change the color to uh, <coughs> something like violet or between violet and rose. Let's decrease the text size and move it right. Let's add some mask to the text. Let's animate it. A 
another keyframe in the start something like 15 frames and let's ease, ease them go to speed value and uh, make some editing let's make it so far to one second and add a motion blur to it let's jump to the other text and add a mask and animate the opacity decrease it to zero then animate the position let's jump to the zero another keyframe make it easy ease then increase the range texture to 100 Cool. And let's add some motion blur to it. All right. Then precompose all. Add a keyframe to the scale and make it easy ease. Something like uh, 129. And edit the speed value. Something like this. Okay. that's it guys if you like the video don't forget to do like and subscribe to our channel to make us make more contents like this thanks for watching